Your body will start to produce breast milk at about your fifth month of pregnancy. Um, it's colostrum, which is the first milk that your baby will obtain. It's very thick and rich and full of immunoglobulins, full of vitamin E, um, but it is, does not come out pouring. It's very, very concentrated. Um, and so it's teaspoons worth. It is not a lot, but it gives your baby the best beginning. And then by day three, four, five, with constant stimulation of every two to three hours during the day of a feeding or a pumping, then your, your milk will start to transition over into more mature milk. And that's when we feel the full breasts and the possible engorgement. In the very beginning, when you first deliver, you're not going to feel an overwhelming amount of milk, but it's the perfect amount for the baby. On day one, at birth, the baby's stomach is only the size of a marble. And by day three, it's the size of a shooter marble. By day 10, it's the size of a ping pong ball. So the baby has taught your body how much to produce by nursing frequently, and it will eventually even out to what the baby can take. So the baby's stomach expands to start to accept exactly how much you're, you're, you're producing. Again, you might feel that there's a little bit of an overwhelming amount in the first couple of days. That's very, very normal. But as your milk changes over from the colostral phase to the more mature milk, you're bound to having a little bit of engorgement um, just because of the extra fluid.